this video, we prepare carbon monoxide, a useful gas in the laboratory and in the industry. For example, it is used for the preparation of methanol and for the reduction of metal oxides. We plan to synthesize nickel tetracarbonyl in an upcoming video, so we decided to make a separate video on the synthesis of carbon monoxide. The easiest way for the synthesis of carbon monoxide in the lab is to dehydrate methanoic acid, otherwise known as formic acid. If we take a look at the structure of formic acid, we can see that by removing one molecule of water, carbon monoxide is left. This can be accomplished with a lot of dehydrating agents. It is most convenient to use concentrated sulfuric acid. Actually, methanoic acid is prepared from carbon monoxide. So let's get started. First, we measure out around 10 milliliters of 85% formic acid and 10 milliliters of 98% sulfuric acid. These are then charged into a 50 milliliter round bottom flask. Immediately, we can observe some effervescence in the flask. The reaction rate is easily controlled by adjusting the temperature of the mixture. Heating will increase the production of carbon monoxide quite drastically. As you can see, the carbon monoxide burns with a very nice, white, blue flame. <laughs> 